So we partner with several nonprofits in the city who will send women our way when they're ready to get back on their feet. Women who are overcoming different backgrounds of adversity, including overcoming homelessness, battling mental illness, or trying to transition out of the sex industry. Through meeting with different organizations, meeting with different women overcoming adversity, saw that there was a gap in employment and that women were motivated to work but maybe lacked skills, experience, or confidence to be hired. We work out of a space called The Red on Salmon, which is a food hub for a lot of different local food companies. I think ownership is huge, and so mm -hmm. the fact that people can join the team and we tell them, like, this is your area, whether it's being the mixer in the kitchen or owning fulfillment in the warehouse, we're going to give you that responsibility, and oftentimes they haven't been given responsibility like that in a while, and the fact that we're willing to trust them with that and tell them, like, no, you're owning this, you're going to take this from A to B, that sits with them a lot. I was making nut butters on the side of my full-time job because I couldn't eat any that were on the market. All of our nut butters are peanut free and also free of any refined sugar, or added oils or preservatives that you'll find in a lot of other nut butters. We do use a sweetener, we use a little bit of honey, but less than a tablespoon per jar. And we mostly use almonds, cashews, and hazelnut. A blend of these nuts makes for a really creamy nut butter, and it's more like a treat than your average jar of peanut butter. So not only are customers getting a really healthy product made of clean ingredients that makes you feel good and actually fuels your life, but they're also part of a bigger mission of spreading good in the community and providing opportunities to women overcoming adversity.